Hi guys, today I'll be synthesizing benzaldehyde from benzyl alcohol. Benzyl alcohol contains a benzene ring with a hydroxymethyl group, which can be oxidized to an aldehyde group, forming benzaldehyde. Some uses of benzaldehyde are in fragrances, flavorings, pharmaceuticals, and dyes, and also illegal drug synthesis. But this is strictly for educational purposes. Here's acetone for the solvent. It's a product, so it doesn't donate hydrogen bonds and interfere. And it's polar, which boosts solubility, mixing, and reaction control. I'll use 50 milliliters. For the oxidizer, I'm using activated manganese dioxide. It's a mild reagent that oxidizes primary alcohols into aldehydes without pushing them further to carboxylic acids, like benzoic acid in this case. To ensure full conversion of the benzyl alcohol to benzaldehyde, I'll use 20 grams of manganese dioxide. I'll heat the reaction safely and evenly using an oil bath. I'll set the oil bath to about 60 degrees Celsius. That's warm enough to accelerate the reaction without causing over-oxidation or decomposition. Chemically, what's happening is an oxidation reaction. The benzyl alcohol is being oxidized by manganese dioxide. It targets the primary alcohol group and converts it into an aldehyde. That black solid is spent manganese dioxide. I'll separate it out using gravity filtration. The clear liquid contains our target product, benzaldehyde. It still needs to be purified to separate it from the acetone. I'll use some simple distillation, which separates liquids based on their boiling points. The filtrate in the round bottom flask gets heated in the oil bath. Water flows around the inner tube, cooling the vapor so it condenses into liquid. Cold water in goes on the bottom, and water out comes from the top. So first the acetone boils off. And once the thermometer reads about 180 degrees Celsius, I collect the condensed liquid in the receiver flask, giving me purified benzaldehyde. It smells like sweet and bitter almonds. That's all for today, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe.